At last month's student forum, several students voiced their concern regarding the new housing policy at Darden State College. The policy states that all guests must sign in. Even if the guest is another student at Darton living in another dorm, they must also sign in. The guest cannot stay overnight unless they are signed in specifically as an overnight guest. Clay Watkins, Director of Housing and Residence Life at Darton State, says that the policy is not as strict as other universities. Universities around the state of Georgia um, using UGA as a, a background, um, they have biometric hand scanners, things like that. Um, they use their key cards with hologram stickers on it from dorm to dorm. Watkins says that the policy is very fair and at other universities students are faced with serious consequences if they break the rules. You know the rules are very fair. Um, at Darden State College y'all get 30 seconds to walk to the desk and then just sign your guest in and make sure that everything is taken care of and then sign them out. Um, again you could be at a big college like UGA and stuff like that they have what we call pass-ins. After a certain amount of pass-ins they will send you to a judicial hearing if you lose your ID card. Darton student Shane Walter says he feels safe, but thinks that the rules are a bit excessive. I mean, we pay these big sums of money to go into live in these student housing, and while the protection is there, uh, I feel like we're being restricted by having to sign in, having to stop, sign our friends in, sign our families in. It's just necessary in some points, but at the point where people who live there are putting being put at a disadvantage I think that it's not really necessary. Watkins says that the main reason for all these rules and regulations is students safety. The reason we do that again is you know it's just safety is all it is. Um, from 210 people in one building and then 251 in the other and then you add them all together just moving back and forth it would be very difficult to keep up with them. Emily Atkinson, a student at Darton State, says that while the policy may be annoying at times, it is there to keep the students safe. I agree to the extent like it keeps us safe and I do agree with like the safety policies and compared to other universities, you know, it's very nonchalant. So I mean it gets annoying when you have to sign in constantly for your friends to come over, but really like it's for the benefit and well-being of our students, so I totally agree. For Cavalier Connection, this is Casey Sanders reporting.